All right, well, continuing with the summer-like pattern as we do start out this work week, as you can see, a little bit of a gloomy start with overcast skies all over central Georgia. Down in Dublin, that is the case as well, but still warm temperatures, 82 degrees already at the midday hour. Winds out of the west, southwest at three miles an hour, not really having much of an influence on the temperature in terms of the winds, but the dew points are really making it feel a little bit warmer out there. So as you can see, a couple low 80s, some, even some mid 80s already, like Warner Robins at 85, and then areas further to the north still in those upper 70s. So warming on up a little bit warmer than we have been the past couple of days. If you remember Saturday, we were stuck around the 80 degree mark yesterday, somewhere around the mid 80s and going to extend into the upper 80s as we get throughout today. So you can see cloud cover all over central Georgia, maybe a little bit of a sprinkle further down in our southwestern counties. But when you take a look at what's going on across the southeast, not much except these pop up showers and storms that we have seen the past couple of days. But over to the west, yes, the southern plains are expecting a very active day today. So if you have any friends and family over there. Go ahead and let them know to stay weather aware today and also to have their severe weather safety plan in place. So we'll take it through today in central Georgia. As you can see, a pop up shower or a storm once we get into the heat of the day around 3 p.m. That looking to be further in our northern counties, whereas we did see those further down to the south and to the west yesterday across central Georgia. We take it through into the night and as you can see, maybe a scattered sprinkle throughout the overnight hours. Anywhere that does see that uh, sprinkle chance or a sh rain shower overnight going to to see some lingering fog in the morning starting out Tuesday in the 60s and then we are bouncing back into those upper 80s but starting a little bit of a drier trend so this is 4 p.m. on Tuesday notice not seeing any of those pop up showers or storms like we have seen the past couple of days and then once again maybe an overnight shower as we go into Wednesday morning starting out somewhere around the 70 degree mark already before we bounce up into the 90s across almost all of central Georgia right there but also once again a drier day so the midweek trending dry before we shift our focus to Thursday so going to go ahead and note we do have a severe weather chance already about a 15% chance of seeing severe thunderstorm warnings around this area in central Georgia. All of us are in here, but note this area extends all the way from Columbus basically up to New Jersey. So we are going to continue to play it by ear and keep a close eye on this severe weather chance. But as you can see, the timing of it looking like sometime Thursday afternoon. And if this does progress a little bit faster, it comes in in the morning hours on Thursday. It won't have as much heat of the day to bounce up uh, severe thunderstorm warnings or anything worse than that. So We'll continue to play it by ear, but as you can see, leading into a wet Thursday evening all the way into the overnight hours and lingering on into Friday morning, maybe a little bit into Friday afternoon as well. But once that front does clear, you can see setting up for a nice and dry Mother's Day weekend. So that will be the good news with this. Maybe a slight chance of rain as we do go into the overnight hours on Monday, but we'll time that out as we get closer, but warm for the first part of the week. And after that front clears, let's drop it on down to the 70s and 50s for a nice and cool Mother's Day. Okay.